You know, two years ago we were here in Piscataway, New Jersey, and you know, the weather wasn't too bad, but this year there was great threat for rain. You know, the bands on the field were getting ready for a very exciting game, but the threat for rain is going to be great. I got my, uh, my little slicker here. We're going to put this on if it gets rainy and uh, do our very best. It'll be radio sound like it always is, TV picture from ESPN 2, and they're the ones that carried this game. Hurricane Matthew is visiting with its remnants in Piscataway, New Jersey. However, the crowd is flocking in for number four Michigan, the unbeaten Wolverines, to take on the Scarlet Knights this evening. Rutgers has been in the Big Ten for about as long as this little one's been around. However, it's a budding rivalry in the Big Ten in New Jersey because Michigan's Jim Harbaugh has planted a maize and blue flag in the middle of the Garden State. He held a camp here and has recruited heavily here. Tonight, Jim Harbaugh brings his Wolverines into Piscataway undefeated. But in motion to the right. Pitch sweep, Ty Isaac around the right end. He's got the corner, the five, the one. Touchdown, Michigan. Ty Isaac on the power sweep. Spate takes the snap, looks left, back to throw. Now he steps up in the pocket, throws the ball deep down the left sideline. That ball is caught! Touchdown, Michigan! Holy cow, with a diving grab! J. Hugh Chesson and the Wolverines extend their lead. How about Rutgers travails? They're looking at Jabril Peppers as the Wildcat quarterback here. First and goal from the four. Peppers rolls to his right. Now he breaks it up inside at the five, the four. He's in for a score, Jabril Peppers. Michigan on the board again. Under center is Spate. And there is a timeout <laughs> called by Chris Ash. And they gave the ball to the, the hammer. hammer. The hammer. And the hammer got over in. the pile. The uh, television crew told us there were going to be a timeout, and then they decided not to have a timeout. So while you were away, Michigan was at work. And the Wolverines gave the ball to Khalid Hill, the hammer, from a half a yard out. And he went in for the score. And then Jim Harbaugh, with a little bit of ledger domain, a little bit of a surprise <laughs> on the extra point, let Garrett Moores, the holder, pick it up on a fake extra point try they blocked it up front and garrett morse walked in untouched as michigan extended the score to 29 to nothing over rutgers with 11:57 left to play here in piscataway evans the tailback under center is spate fourth and goal the give to the hammer did he get in they have not signaled it yet The referees are in there. Touchdown, Michigan! And Khalid Hill does what he does best from the one-yard line. And that's score! <laughs> Peppers waiting for the ball. Gets it. He will run left, and he'll score. Five, four, three, two, one. Touchdown, Jabril Peppers. Quarterback sweep left. With that speed, there's no chance for <laughs> Rutgers. And Michigan rolls out to a 42-0 lead. Under center, O'Corn. Evans in the backfield. Offset eye to the left. Back to throw, O'Corn. Straight back. Looking right. Throws right flat. He's got Khalid Hill at the 10. The 5 to the pylon. And in. And the hammer scores that time from the air. And Michigan extends their lead. Shane Morris, the quarterback, up under center. Two tight ends. The give. Evans over left guard. He's got it to the 5. He's into the end zone. Touchdown. 15 yards. Michigan scores again. Higdon now in it, the running back, offset eye to the left. The give is to Bobby Henderson, and Henderson at the five. He's at the one. He's in the fullback. Bobby Henderson scores for Michigan. Higdon is the lone setback behind O'Corn. O'Corn on the draw play to Higdon. He's at the 40, the 30, the 25, the 20, the 10. He's going to score. Five. Touchdown, Karan Higdon from 43 yards away. Michigan scores again and I tell you what Nolan Illusio absolutely pancaked the linebacker on that play and that was the last man standing Ryan Tice to try the extra point and he just puts it on the board and Michigan is up 71 to nothing over Rutgers 
with 9.20 left to play. The most points since 1939 against the University of Chicago when the Wolverines put up 85. This is Michigan football. Well, I tell you what, we knew coming into this game that Michigan had more talent, that they were most likely going to win this game, but I would have never guessed 11 touchdowns. Two tight ends, eye formation. Give to the tailback Isaac. Right guard breaks a tackle. 25, 20, 15, 10 to the corner. Five, touchdown inside the pylon. Ty Isaac from 34, Michigan touchdown. 77 to nothing, Michigan. And Ryan Tice out there to look and make it 78. I mean, wow. Mm. Here's the snap. The placement down. The kick is up. And Ryan Tice is good with the extra point. And Michigan has just tacked on another point to make it 78 to nothing. Rutgers. Now, you get in a game like this, John, and there are people out there that might say, Coach Harbaugh is running it up. He has done nothing but keep the ball on the ground. He's running his second team players. He is putting running backs in the game that have all played, but the rotation has gone through. Yeah. You can't say that. He hasn't no. thrown the ball or tried to do something over the top. It's just been it has a massive win for Michigan and completely outmanned. <laughs> Clock running with 18 seconds. Michigan leaves Piscataway, New Jersey with a 78-0 win over Rutgers. As Michigan rolls here in Piscataway, 78 to nothing. You're listening to Michigan Football. Wow, what a game that was. At the end of the third quarter, we thought they were gonna get seven points on the board, but the ball skipped just a little. You heard the guys on the radio say that. And it's amazing. There's hardly anybody left in the stadium. Absolutely fantastic. And next week, of course, it's the bye week. We'll be heading back to Michigan. We got a week off to recover <laughs> from all these points. And then, of course, it's homecoming with uh, Illinois. So off we go back to Michigan. I'm Art Volo for the University of Michigan. And we say, let's go blue.